Hey yo, what's going on everybody, it's Tyler, it's aka it's a Killing 10, yeah man, alright, you knew this had to happen, you knew what was going to happen, alright, animals are in GTA 5 online, you can eat some peyote and you can turn into a whole bunch of different types of animals, and of course, I must accept the challenge that nobody has asked for, I must abuse myself for no reason at all, except for your entertainment. I will attempt to cross the map of GTA 5 Online in a wild public lobby as a dog. Can it be done? I don't know. Who knows, right? We'll have to watch and find out through the rest of the video. But listen, this is the thing. We can't be going on the outskirts of the map. We can't be taking the highways for the whole entire way. This is not going to, you can't do that. We got to cut through downtown. We got to go through the city. All right. And I'm a dog. I mean, the map's going to be there, but I can't read it. I can't even see it. I don't even see color. And every time I see a squirrel, I go crazy and I lose my mind. I have no idea what I'm doing or where I'm going afterwards. I have to completely reset myself, okay? So this challenge is going to be Herculean. It's going to be practically impossible. But why do it? Who know? Who cares? For the views? No. No one's going to watch. It doesn't matter. I do it for the challenge. For the love of the game, because why the hell not, man? I mean, you know, and if I don't do it, somebody else is going to do it, right? And I've got some of the sickest challenges done in GTA 5 Online. So might as well continue. All right, here we go. We're kicking it off. I am a gray husky, and this is my first attempt. Now, I have a checkpoint on the map, and it doesn't matter if, you know, there's a map or not. It really does. I mean, I, I have no idea where I'm going. I'm going to have to check regardless. I mean, I'm not, I'm not a total complete idiot. I need to be able to navigate where I'm going on here, okay? I mean, Jesus. Again, I'm a dog, okay, people? For the love of God. Not only do I have to dodge these crazy-ass players in this lobby that are just rabid with, you know, bloodlust and wanting to murder everything... The NPCs are just as bad. They don't care that I'm a beautiful, loving, blue-eyed husky. All they want to do is just drive and run over everything that they possibly can. They don't care. They crash into each other. They crash into, you know, regular players. And anytime somebody, you know, lets off a, a loud bang of anything, the whole lobby just shuts. All the NPCs go crazy. So I'm having to play Frogger over here. Sniff a butter too, you know, on the way. So what? Don't judge me. I'm a dog. It's what we do. It's like me saying what's up, all right? So getting pretty far. I'm actually kind of impressed. However, here we go. We got our first looky-loo. Our first, uh, I don't know what this is, a stalker maybe. Maybe they're just perplexed that a beautiful, gorgeous, blue-eyed husky is, you know, galloping around in GTA 5 online. So he honks his horn a couple of times. I, you know, say what's up, a few barks here and there. And then I just go about my business. Hopefully he's not a psychopath and doesn't run me down like the animal that I am. But I'm a good animal, not a bad one, though. All right, I haven't ate nobody up or killed nobody. I'm just doing my thing. Yet, for blocks, he continues to follow honk his horn. Like, what, what am I going to do? Get inside the car? No, I don't have thumbs. I'm a dog. I can't grip anything, all right? It's not going to work, buddy. I can't get into your cool car. I'm sorry. If you open the door, stranger danger. And you got to show me the candy before I get in, okay? I need to see the kibbles and bits before I get in. I ain't slipping, all right? Come on now, buddy. So he's pressing me, getting a little too close for comfort. I'm not liking it one bit. There's cop sirens blaring. Whoa, 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 easy guy. I just bolt for it. I freak out, see a squirrel, bam, hit this freaking car. The driver doesn't back up. I die. You know what? I need somebody's help. I'm going to reach out to my homie Franklin. I'm going to hit him up. I need to talk to him. I'm going to go by his crib and see if... um. See if we can't bring a little friend of ours back from story mode. See if he can't help me out. Who's a good boy? Yes, you are, Choppy Chop. Chop's a good boy. 
That's right. Chop's going to help us out with this. A beautiful Rottweiler. A luxurious, utilitarian, stout breed. Very graceful. Very, very just honest breed. I mean, uh, did you just break wind in front of us? Chop, did you just break wind in front of us? What was that? What did you? Oh, my God. Do you sm Chop, that was... That was beside you. That was uncalled for. Let's continue on. Hopefully we don't have another. Oh, did you just, did you just twerk out a fart? Chop, what was that? You are a savage. I love it. Oh my God. That was rank, bro. Ah, uh, you need to talk to Franklin to stop feeding you Cheetos, dude. Anyways, we continue on. Of course, we're going through the heart of this city i'm taking lefts rights zigzagging just to make sure we go through with this the right way all right pushing on just keep moving keep striving forward and i'm not gonna lie i'm getting tired i'm i'm playing you know i'm chop right now you know is it me breaking wind i don't know is it chop it's one of us okay it's like a symbiotic relationship we have and one of us is foul i don't know who it is it's chop it's definitely chop he's nasty I love him, but he's nasty. Anyways, I didn't say that. I mean, nobody heard that. But yes, we're going through. We're getting through this. <laughs> we're getting this challenge done, and we're getting it done today. Because honestly, if I don't, you know, do this, I, I'm going to give myself one, maybe two more tries, and after that, I'll just let Sonny do it. He can have at it. I don't care. It's it's whatever. All right, we're pushing through though. We're pretty much in the center of the map. And the lobby is still slap full. We still got some crazies out there. We still got Mark II's flying around. We still got jets flying around. We don't know what's happening. NPCs are still crazy. They're still driving like they don't care about anything or anyone, whatever. I'm used to it by now. Okay, I can't tell you how much money I've lost from NPCs crashing into my cars, my post-op vans, all that stuff. So we're pushing further north. We're in Blaine County. You know, it's it's a cold night. It was a hot, dry day. I'm getting thirsty. I haven't had no water, no kibbles, no bits, no Cheetos. The pavement is ice cold. But earlier today, it was wicked hot. My paws are dry and crusty. My nails are digging into the ground. It is not fun anymore, okay? I'm like, why am I doing this challenge? I should be chasing squirrels, eating up small rodents, pooing everywhere that I want to, you know, but no, I'm doing this ridiculous challenge, trying to get across the map, you know, what, how, how else can we get across the map, we've got meth labs, I went across, I, I, I circled the map in a slow, stupid tugboat, I made it rain with a million dollars on top of Maze Bank, what else do we have to do, okay, it's ridiculous, it's just, it's just, whatever, anyways, I get to a point up here, I am just exhausted, exhausted. I realize I've made a wrong turn. I am totally off track. Again, I can't see where I'm going. All I can see is black and white. I'm a dog, okay? And I got crazies on the left, and I got crazies on the right. I don't know what to do. Should I just push on? Should I just give this whole thing up? I don't know. I'm like, should I, just go, should I go back? I don't know. I decide... To push on. We've already come this far. If I get killed up here, I'm done. I'm, I'm just uninstalling the game. No, not really. Uh, I'm just going to jump on you know, something else. Some Red Dead or some Warzone. Just put this whole challenge behind me. But no, I'm Chop. I'm a gangster. All right? I'm a G. I got to get this done. Nobody can stop me. I'm going to push through. I'm going to make it happen. All right? I'm going to be the first one as a dog that I know of. I don't know. I have no idea. Maybe. Probably. Kind of. I don't know. To cross the map in GTA 5 Online, all right? And I'm doing it in style as the big homie Chop. Ain't nobody else doing it like old Ty Kills. Ain't nobody else like old Ty Larrys. You know this now. This was sketchy right here. Cars are driving by me like an 80 mile an hour, okay? And right here, I'm, I'm freaking out. Chop is like, bro, I don't know if we can make it the rest of the way. We almost got hit like 10 times. Pushing on. Keep it moving. Keep it grooving. There's no losing, okay? Absolutely not. We're, I can taste it. I can smell the salt in the air from the ocean. I love it. We're almost there. So I'm pushing on. I cross over the, the interstate, the highway, the road, whatever. Make sure no cars hit me. And we're almost there, folks. 
Polito Bay, all damn day, make way, chops coming through. Okay? Easy, breezy, beautiful cover girl. We get there, and man, I, I am so proud of myself. I'm so proud of Chop. Just hanging in there. I mean, come on. Who's a good boy? Huh? Who did it? Who did it, Chop? Big Chopper. Yeah, you did it. Good boy. Yes, you are. You're a good boy. Yes, you are. <laughs> yeah, Chop's good boy. Definitely. No worries at all. No hesitations. No problems whatsoever. Chop is the man. I love him. Oh, my God. <laughs> Perfect. I wouldn't have had it any other way. We did it, folks. We crossed the map in GTA 5 Online as a dog and as Chop nonetheless. I hope you enjoyed the video. That was awesome to make. A lot of fun. Really did enjoy it. I hope you guys enjoyed it, too. Definitely, if you want to see more content, subscribe to the channel. Smash, I mean, smooth smash that like button. And we'll see you guys in the next one, right? Peace out. Yeah.